Right, hello and welcome to another vlog for Vlogtober 2020. Right, what a morning we've had, ladies and gentlemen, and everyone else in between. Or the left or the right, either side, whatever, okay? Um, we have had um, a bit of an eventful morning. If you watched yesterday's vlog, we worked flat out, okay, all day, yeah. Uh, then we very quickly went to get some food for our evening meal, then we had a Skype call, and then practically went to bed, okay. Um, so it basically, the moral of the story of that is that yesterday we worked really, really hard. And this morning we discovered that all of the work that we did <laughs> had a um, spelling mistake. <laughs> And it wasn't just one, it was one small mistake, but throughout all of the work. So we had to change that, then we had to do some other couple of bits and bobs. Um, so it was something that we thought was going to take us about 15 minutes to do, uh, as took us uh, three hours to do. We started at 11 and it's now 2 o'clock. We're going to take the dogs out for a walk um, because currently, um, if you watched the previous couple of vlogs that where we were putting some reindeer um, in our local village, um, basically, um, they are melting because of the rain, so we're putting out new ones that, um, uh, that are waterproof, right? However, um, so we're going to go do that. Then I've got a, a massive project to finish today because it um, needs to be sorted out for tomorrow. And then I think um, I might collapse. Uh, so, yeah, not the greatest. Um, how are you? Hey, you're pretending like you're on the bloody front line NHS. I'm not. Oh, I've got so much work to do. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what I have to deal with as a boyfriend. I just asked Ruben, uh, Aiden to very quickly just hold um, Bonnie's lead, of which he did for about a second and then dropped it. Oh. Bonnie then ran through the mud, okay, running away from Scare her lead that, that, scare, that, <laughs> that was scaring her. So I've refused to now carry it because it's his fault it's absolutely filthy. Now I'm happy. And now he's, I'll, uh, he's happy. I'll, I'll wash my pants when I get home. Yeah. Wash your pants. Wash my pants and my socks. <laughs> Finally, because you haven't done that since January. No, you dirty bugger. There you go, Commando. Oh, um, dirty. No, I don't like that. Only on Ori fans. I'll get me pain trapped in a zipper. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, never mind, never mind. You having fun, Ruben? Ruben, come. Good boy. Funny. Uh, have you got a mucky face? Have you got mud on your face, you big disgrace? Mucky bungers. Oh, bye. <laughs> Hi guys, so I have just come out of the shower, hence why I don't like a straight, okay? Um, I do. Um, I am mentally exhausted. Um, <laughs> we obviously went for a walk with the dogs, um, et cetera, et cetera. I've wanted to do some, so much stuff to do today and I haven't got through the list and I feel as though that's been like the case for the past couple of days. However, <laughs> you would, believe it or not, I am actually very happy. Um, as we have just got confirmation that um, our, um, without going into it too much, but our business just got a little bit bigger as uh, we're going to be doing some work for um, someone new. So it's absolutely fantastic. Um, so we, we're, all, we're over the moon uh, with that result. <laughs> um, I'm really, really pleased that we're going to do it. However, um, I want to lots of work done ahead of time yeah um so, and it's coming up to christmas and i would have just liked a couple of days off so I, i'm gonna have to try and like just swallow me pride and try to relax um etc etc also I, I said this a couple of well about i don't know two weeks ago and i've also told, told friends about it about three weeks ago i got a new game on the 20th of november and it's the 18th of december today and for me nintendo switch and i still haven't had time to play it oh. So, yeah, okay, I do watch TV on a night with Aiden, but like, so I'm just being like 11 o'clock at night or whatever. Um, so, like, I, and I just want to be able to, you know, what, I'm, what I'm after is just a one day of a break where I, where I don't feel guilty that I've got stuff to do. Do you know what I mean? Whether it's, um, I've got three vlogs to edit or two vlogs or a 1.1 vlog, um, or, um, work for our business or blah, 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 blah. War is me, war is me. That is enough of my yeah, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna quit complaining. I'm gonna be editing for the next two and a half hours, and I probably will watch this back and be like, Ryan, change your tone, you miserable. Um, like it. 
I'm just tired. You sound like Aiden. That could have really gone bad, badly, couldn't it? That could have squished Bonnie. Anyways, what's happening? Wait, oh God, I've dropped this. Don't touch that, Bonnie. Right, ignore the quilt hanging over the banister. Oh. If you watched the previous couple of vlogs, you know that Bonnie peed on the quilt, right? So just drag it. Now, a lot of you might remember this from the hallway in the flat if you've been watching us for a couple of years. So we're just going to be putting this on, on the wall. Um, I mean, it, it essentially just leans up against I've the wall practically. I've got some of these self-drill. So uh, we've got this to find us. So we're gonna we're so gonna we're, bad boys we're gonna see if it, how it goes. All right, we'll show you the finished products. Hey everybody. So I've just been doing this. As you see, these things are miraculous. These, can you see them? Little screws. Focus screw. I'll have to go out of the camera shot because it won't focus on. I don't want to focus on the screw. Focus on the screw. I'll come here. Anyway, you see it. It's not on product mode, so it just doesn't want to focus on the screw. Anyway, it's a screw. It's this one here. You don't have to drill them into the wall. You basically just push them and then twist them with a screwdriver. And it's there for, you know, they're for just stud walls. And I just think that's great. You're not risking anything. You just you drill into the thing and then you can put the screw inside the little hole. So I'm absolutely over the moon for these. I'm going to put them in. I'm going to... Um, I'm gonna put this up and I'm just learn how to use my stud finder. I'm turning into a DIY guru. What are you gonna do, eh? DIY SOS, here I come. Ta da! All done. And then, although I've got a Wi Fi uh, extender underneath there, so it's like popping the door out, but I'll put it under an extension cable and then we're all sorted. Now I'm gonna put the mirror up because it's going on this wall right here. And I'll show you once I'm done. God damn it! You see? And three, two, one. We are done. So I've put this up, me mirrors up, to have the hallway of me flat all over again. Hello, now I can do the thing you know on Americans on the TikToks when they go <sighs> in a mirror. Now we can't really do in England because we don't have bathroom mirrors that are big enough unless you're real bougie and went to a private school. So hi everyone. Hi there. Bunny, bunny, do the bunny, bunny. She's gorgeous. We've just eaten. Yeah, right, we've just eaten, and we're just sitting down to watch Homeland. And turn the camera around. Love to vlog Christmas. And, oh, very full. Watching Homeland is a surprise. Now, I um, after I did the mirror upstairs, I came down, Grant's been editing, he's been just sitting by, bless him, he's just been sit by that computer doing nothing else. So I've just been kind of tackling a few jobs. Though in the end I actually needed Ryan's help, so, but it's still, I've still done them at least. So I've put the mirror up, I've put that carpenter up upstairs. I was going to take the, um, the Good. curtains up because they need to be taken up because they're a bit too long. However, the, the webbing, you know, that kind of like iron on web, the hem thing that you can buy was not working and I don't know why. I think it might be because they're quite thick curtains. Now, so I can sew yeah, and I could do them. Yeah. But I don't want the pressure of mess in case I mess it up. That's exactly because I was I was with the iron right and I was trying to figure out like the best way to do it and I was kinda so probably stood there for a half an hour like, right, how am I gonna do this? Because usually with things I'm just quite slapdash because I haven't got time to work stuff out. So usually I'm just kinda like better than yeah it'll do. And that's probably why most things don't work. <laughs> um, however, with this, right, I was like, I need to do it properly. So I was like measuring it perfectly, folding it all over. And I was just ready to iron. So I grabbed the iron and ironed it. Didn't work. Maybe I'd made the hem too thick. Maybe the hem webbing was, was from a cheap shop. So maybe it was just bad. Maybe I wasn't doing it right. Who knows? So quick Google search and we can get... So there's a like a local shop that takes curtains up and it's to be honest it's barely anything it's a takeaway do you know what i mean it wasn't 20 quid 20 quid it's well um you know we'll have them for however long you know what i mean so definitely Just worth doing tell it. them what, what currently is happening currently you know um sandwich bag clips that you can use they're actually for the fridge so you put them on the fridge they? they've got magnets on so you, oh, you nice. magnetize them to the fridge and then they're little clips so you can like clip stuff to them shopping list receipts that Food kind of clips. things Food clips. 
you can all, we use them for food clips. We actually use them for the dog food to wrap the um, dog food bags back up. But you can use them for that. So the, we've got clips on the bottom at the minute to hold it up because they're so long. So we need to get them taken up. So tomorrow I'll phone them and see what happens. But we're just going to sit for another 45 minutes or so and watch this TV show before we go to bed. Because um, Ryan's got a busy day tomorrow as well and I've got a busy day. I just wanted to quickly mention before I do say, a few people have been commenting recently and you know it hasn't just happened once kind of expressing um their opinion that ryan talks over me that ryan you know doesn't it's let mean me it's me doesn't let me talk um and you know putting their opinions forward not really backing it up and two also um i must reiterate and i must tell you you only see a glimpse into our lives. We've got a camera in our hands, right? When we are talking. So when you see that, now I know that's just obvious, obviously, Aiden, wait, what's your point here? My point is that we are the ones that decide what goes in that vlog. You know, I'm right, I, I, we both watch it and we both go, okay, that's fine. You know, we understand each other. We know exactly what we're like. Ryan puts up with loads of that I do and I put up with some stuff that Ryan does we are in a relationship we totally totally right signed up for that mm -hmm. now I sometimes I'm a nightmare when it comes to vlogging because I stand in front of this camera and sometimes I can't think of what to say sometimes um, I say you know and 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 sometimes I think to I'll myself tell I'll tell a story I'll miss bits out you know or I'll kind of I'll have a moment a, a brain fart and I can't think of what to say and Ryan always comes to me rescue and is the person who talks I right if you can believe even though I do vlog I'm naturally pretty quiet like I'm not really that much of a talk of person I don't really string up conversations with people that often but Ryan is the one that kind of supports me in that if I need him he's the one that can have the conversation when I don't want to talk so I like him that way so please right you don't have to say stop talking over Aiden I, I don't want him to stop I like it when he comes in and brings in the conversation and, and kind of finishes me sentences for us. I am happy about that. So you can stop, right? Um, commenting on it, please. The, Those of you who are doing it. Um, the irony is, when I was trying to talk to you about Mauritius, yeah. yeah, Ryan's just said it and it's true. The irony is, often off camera, I'm the one that puts in his conversations when he's trying to tell us. And... Um, not to be self-deprecating as well, but I'm I'm not very good at, um, you know, I kind of zone out of having conversations with people and stuff, which is not a nice trait to have. So, but you don't get to see that because it's not on the vlog. So we've all got our flaws, we all do things, and please understand that I don't want him to change, I'm really quite happy, and though you might think that he's talking over me, he really is just helping just me get through the videos. Reason. What, what, like, what like, else has people said? Um, I've been meaning overbearing. I've, I've, meaning overbearing. I've, I've seen some of the comments that you've that you've. I think honestly, if you, I mean, you know, if you knew that, if you've kind of like come to this channel and you watch one video and you leave me in comment, right? It doesn't really matter. Like, it's not very nice, obviously. But I see comments from people who watch our videos quite often. Now, though we love that you watch the videos all the time, I kind of don't. I shouldn't really have to say. Um, you know, if you've not got anything nice to say, don't say it at all. I mean, it's a chi it's a childish comment and I don't want to sound patronising, but really, if you watch it, please don't be. Like, it's just not necessary. Um, especially if you're coming just to enjoy and to kind of zone out from the world for a little bit just to watch us, right? Um, and of course, people might argue, well, we put our life on camera, so we're kind of open to um, people's opinions and criticism. And and yes, we are. Um you know, I agree people are, can, um, they, they can comment uh, if they want. However, usually we, we, we either block those people or we refrain from letting them comment on our posts. That's what and, block is. Oh, right, yeah, that's what block is. And we don't want to do that with people who watch our videos. Why, why on earth would we want to do that? But if you keep negatively commenting about things that Ryan's doing or that I am doing, um, we will be doing that. Can you turn the camera on me? Yeah. Don't want to interrupt, right? But, um, basically, um, so I've oh, I totally forgot the point. That's why I have the time I'll interrupt, is because I don't remember, and if I don't say it, I won't remember it, yeah? Um, it's getting you down though, isn't it? It's not that it's getting us down. It's the fact that, as Aidan said, you're seeing 
a tiny snippet of our lives. Yeah. If you uh, you said in one comment, Aiden, to, to respond in, to one of the mean comments, um, that uh, oh, I'm losing the absolute train of thought. You've been doing a lot of work today, so it's totally um, me, me, my, my mind's just like absolutely gone. Um, I need you to un understand that if I wasn't happy with the vlog content, right, I wouldn't put it on. You can comment something negative, right? So if I started slagging off Joe Biden or Donald Trump or someone, okay, and you felt different, you can comment and disagree with us, yeah, okay? That is absolutely fine. But if you're going to slag either Aiden or myself off, right, um, which is a British term for bitch or complain, right? Make sure that you're getting the whole story. And yeah, I might be interrupting Aiden quite a bit on the camera, right? But but as in Aiden said, th throughout our day, daily occurrence, yeah, Aiden interrupts me just as much as I interrupt him. He annoys me just as much as I annoy him. Yeah, it was, it, like, and again, half the time, we're not really doing these vlogs. Um, like, just, right? to share on the internet. One of the main reasons why I do this, is, especially when my nana's in them, is so then when we have kids, I can show them video footage and then therefore hear the person's laughter and voice and stuff of their great grandma and then their great great grandma, yeah? In like when, in 50 years time. Something that I couldn't have of my grandpa like great grandparents because all, all I got was a black and white photo, mm. et cetera, et cetera. You okay, Reuben? You had enough. Yeah. He's interrupting. That's <laughs> literally stuck. Oh my god, Reuben, will you stop interrupting me? Reuben, stop interrupting Ryan. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you. Anyway, um, that's enough rambling on. That's enough right? rambling. Just understand that you're just seeing a tiny snippet, okay? And if you and and if you regularly comment something negative, right? We have, as Eden said, we have the option of just blocking that person from commenting. We don't have the option of blocking them from the channel because you can obviously still watch whatever. But um, it, and and therefore you can slap, you can say something negative like two times, three times, whatever, and then going forward, you could then start commenting, and we never really see it. Mm. So it's up to you. Hello guys, so I am soaking wet, you can't quite tell because obviously me, I've had my hood up, I've just been outside, um, but here's my top. Um, it, I've just took the dogs out for their last wee and I, I don't think I've told you this, but Bonnie is a bit of a, um, we, me and Ian have said we imagine her being a bit of an Instagram, um, what's the word, uh, an Instagram Influencer, okay, and um, like very, very girly girl, like, and um, also like she's always on the iPhone, and she is um, being like, like, ooh, mud, ooh, rain, yeah, and if it's raining, she won't budge from the step. So I'll obviously take her out, yeah, and I'll stand outside with her. Now Ruben knows exactly why I'm taking outside, so he'll go outside and quickly have a wee, and he's not bothered by the rain because obviously he's experienced it so many times already, and he's been in the swimming pool. He's had multiple baths. He's used to water, etc., etc. But she is not as much um, used to it, and uh, like we just got the impression that she just doesn't like the rain because she doesn't move every single time. And then also, like even when like when there's loads and loads of mud outside, um, when we take her out for a walk, she is a little bit like ooh, ooh, ooh. However, Aiden was oblivious to the fact that it was pouring down with rain, so I was getting absolutely soaking wet, um, as well as the dogs, as he sat on the couch. I took the dogs out, um, and the curtains, right? So I'm gonna shut up now. Right, I won't do any editing with the sound, okay? But hopefully, right now, you'll be able to hear a little bit of background noise, right? Um, which is the rain. So I'm gonna shut up now for like three seconds. And then if I open the curtains, obviously that's a lot more louder, yeah? And um, at least it is in real life. So they have been a blessing, those curtains. Um, me and Aiden really do wish um, we actually uh, put those up a lot sooner, but never mind. Right. Um, Tomorrow, Nana is coming over and um, we might be seeing a couple of our friends to ex exchange gifts. Just at the door, socially distant, very, very quickly, very, very briefly. Um, so, 
um, that might happen and um, lots of other things are going to be happening um, as well so tune in for that but if you've enjoyed this video please give this video a thumbs up if you're new to the channel or haven't already click that subscribe button and also press the notification bell um, so you're notified of when we upload Santa Claus is coming home to me.